Here is one of my favorite exercises that serves a dual purpose. Smoothing out your vocal break or bridge and extending range for high notes. I'm going to show you how to do it in three different ways. It not only works, it also changes your approach. Welcome back to another edition of Victoria's Victorious Vocal Tips. 33 years of teaching voice, 45 years of studying voice, all different styles. My students have ranged from ultra beginners all the way through advanced touring professionals, voice teachers, choral directors, and competition winners. I always give you serious vocal technique made simple and fun. So the exercise is glides over the interval of a third, but a lot of you have done glides. I do them a little bit differently. I do them three different ways. The beauty of the glide is it teaches you how to stretch and thin slowly and gradually into the top note so that you're not tempted to push up weight or disconnect. And by three different ways, I like to start out first slowly like this. That takes a lot of control and you are training the body. Then I do it at a moderate tempo like this. Then if that goes well, we do it fast. So let's first work on the vocal bridge, or in other words, smoothing out the break, as some people call it. Okay, let's say I had trouble in this part of my voice. This is A3 to C sharp 4. This is typically where uh, a lot of baritones start pushing too much weight. We don't thin out too much or else we'll flip into a uh, disconnected head voice. But we don't want to push the weight up, right? So listen. Ah, the power of the glide. Never take it for granted. But here's what I don't want. Ah, see, that's just shouting, pushing up the weight, and it's going to be flat and you're going to have problems. And I also don't want total disconnect like this. Ah, and don't forget about your breath support that helps keeping the vocal folds vibrating efficiently. So let's do it together. Focusing on that glide. No cheating, please. Here we go. Ah, sing. Ah, you can do it in your own range later. Uh, one more. Uh, now, let's do it a little bit higher for, say, the mezzo-sopranos and sopranos, or even for the tenors. So now I'm going to start on E flat four, which for a lot of singers is going to take you right through the bridge. Ah, sing. So, if you're having trouble and you sound like you have the two different voices, which we don't want, then, little tip here, please, make sure that each note has something in common with the note after it. So we don't want, oh, no, oh, you might think of, lightening up a little bit or thinning out the bottom note and singing into the top note again. I think we better do it again. Here we go. Ah. 
So right now we're working on this exercise in the bridge to smooth out any hole or break in the voice. We will deal with extending range into high notes in a few minutes. Okay, now if the slow glide goes well, then I want you to do it at a moderate tempo like this. Oh, here we go. Sing. Uh, I better make sure that you are gliding again, please. So I don't want, oh, uh, and please don't rush. So it's not, oh, uh, we're going to do it faster in a few minutes. But moderate tempo with the glide like this. Uh, sing. 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 So, again, make sure you start on the slow glide first because this is what trains you to make these little micro adjustments gradually. Then you proceed to, to the moderate tempo like we just did. Okay, let's do it a little higher now. I'm going to be at E flat four. Here we go. Oh, sing, sing, sing. Great. Now, if you did well at the slow tempo and the moderate tempo, now it's time to speed up. So we're doing all of these exercises on A. Ah. Personally, my favorite vowel is E. You find your favorite vowel, okay? But we're going to go faster, just touching the top, in and out, like this. Ah, oh, sing. Ah, oh, sing. Sing. We're going to keep going. Sing. Sing. Sliding. Sing. 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 Now, of course, you're supposed to be taking your catch breaths in between, right? Oh, breathe. Oh, if you need help on your breathing and breath support or the catch breath, see my playlist on breathing and breath support. If you're having trouble with the glide and you're just pushing vocal weight up, then you need to see my playlist on the mixed voice. Also, depending upon what style of music you're singing, you should be able to do the moderate tempo and the slow tempo exercises with vibrato and without. I do these exercises every day with students and you can do it too. This is just an example of some of the exercises I have in my audio exercise training program, Victoria's Victoria's Vocal Exercise Program tons of exercises, variable playback speeds like we just did, all different vowels, and it's super affordable. And the best part is I do regular group classes with members and I would like you to join us. So see the link below and sign up right away. So now that you know what you're doing in the exercise, we're going to apply it to extending the range higher. So like I said, same exercise, many purposes, all right? The principle is the same. We are learning to stretch and thin slowly into the upper register so that we're not just pushing our way up. So I'm going to start on F4 like this. Oh, here we go. Slowly. You can do it in your own range later. Leaning into the glide, but not pushing up weight. One more. We're going to continue. Sing. Two more. Oh, 
And you know how much I love the hand signals? Oh, last one, your turn. Okay, now we're ready to do it at a moderate tempo, like this. Oh, sing. Supporting the voice, sing. Don't forget to breathe. We're just going to keep going. Sing. And stick to your vowel. A few more. Throwing the ball if you need to. Oh, two more. Now I know that's too high for some of you, so you can do it in your own range later. And if you get my training program, I have it available in bass baritone, tenor, alto mezzo soprano, and soprano, four different programs. Okay, we're ready to do the exercise quickly, like this. Oh, in and out, go. Sing. Catch breath. Catch breath. Sing. Two more. Now, if you need more help, see my playlist on the vocal bridge or passaggio. And if you want to open up your high notes more easily, see my playlist on how to sing high notes. Thanks for being here, and I'll see you in the next video.